everyone, it's Garrison here and welcome back to the channel. And today, that's right everyone, I'll be continuing this marathon per se of Grand Gravity. Day 2 with Triple S Assemble 24 all the way from Song E to Song H. We got Atmosphere for some reason. Can someone tell me uh, why? Like why is Atmosphere here being proposed when they performed it already? We got Too Hot. And we got Recover It Now and Soul Vice. Gotta admit, love the titling of these tracks that I'm seeing here. But going back to my question, like, they performed Atmosphere already. We already saw the performance and all, uh, whether you saw it in person, lucky you guys, or saw the VOD of it on the YouTube channel and all. But, like, are they just proposing it in case we want it as a title track and by default it ends up being on the album? Hopefully that ends up being the case, right? But for these other tracks, I'm pretty sure they should be new. But if you guys can let me know in the comment section down below if they brought up another track that has been presented to us before in the past before for these votes, be sure to let me know. And let me know your favorites out of the bunch so far for, of course, these exact four tracks out of them. So we're going to narrow it down here all in this listening party but let's just dive into song e first with atmosphere all right i know i have to realize that you can be the one to make me cry you gotta love the lyrics in this song oh my goodness I love the drum kit work, the roll downs in the song, the ticking of the hi hats here. Can't let it go. Like, this has to be by default on the album, regardless. Like, if not title track, please, B side wise, like, this song needs to happen. We need to get that studio version out. Also, please don't change the lyrics because it's already good as is, right? Maybe they'll finalize it per se. In terms of the mixing, mastering, and like everything else though. But yes, we need this to come out regardless. I'm pretty sure we can all agree to that. Alright, on to the next track here. Something new, for sure, surely. Too Hot. Dayan and Katoni. Okay! Ooh. Oh. Wow. A drum, bass type track here? Like, come on! This is fun, energetic, cheerful, what's there not to love? Like, I wouldn't mind this being the title track. Like, this would be, honestly, the type of track where you just can't help but, you know, smiling at the end of the day or at the end of the track. I can foresee that happening for Too Hot here. Just the energy, the free-spiritedness and all. And I could really... For C, meaningful lyrics in this song as well. Keep on going, no one can catch me. I'm super stunning, oh my goodness. Ain't that true? Okay, moving on to the next track here. Recover it now. Hold up. Okay, with So Hyun. Oh my goodness, just that drop. It's got me reminiscent of Rising. This is like the sister to Rising, the follow up of it, I feel like. Ooh. 
That is cool. I like the approach in this particular song. I feel like with the la 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 la, can you feel the la 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 la? Definitely sensing some demo lyrics. I'm sure there's not that many laws in this track if it ends up, you know, happening and to be on the album, you know what I'm saying? But like, I mess with this track a lot. Like, it could be title track, wor it is title track worthy, but it could be the title track as well because it follows it up cleanly from Ryzen. Now, the question is, would I want it to be the title track? I think I'll leave that to the end and really discuss how I'm feeling about all these tracks after I listen to all these tracks, obviously. <laughs> Ooh, I love that rhythm guitar in the back. Ooh. Recover it now, okay. So that was recover it now. Now we're moving on to Soul Vice. Love the titling for this particular track. You been in. I end. Ooh. A little bit of New Jack Swing influence, but the groove, the bass playing out in this song. Wow, that is a cool track. In fact, I would say it would work as the title track. Maybe this is a hot take. I can't be the only one feeling this way. Just the coolness, the the bit of swagger that I'm getting in this song. This like smooth criminal <laughs> type feel, right? But like this almost like cruise control. Night track that would really work. A little bit of turn this, scratch this there, I sense it. The layering. I feel like the vocal layering would be incredible. Incredible if they put out the track fully, which I feel like it needs to happen. It, this is gonna this is a tough decision for this day, I've got to admit. I think I do uh I don't I'm not sure if I really have exact two favorites. Like obviously I love atmosphere. Would I want it as a title track? I wouldn't say so. I want like the likes of Too Hot, where, you know, we're gonna get a whole complete surprise, but something very uplifting, cheerful, and it would totally work into the season of summer, and matter of fact, all year round from what I'm getting, right? And how a bit of the lyrics that I was hearing in that song sounded very promising. Obviously, the lyrics can change. That's what I was saying for Recover It Now, which seemed like the sister a perfect follow-up a seamless follow-up for rising right it would make sense in that kind of manner but then like you got soul vice where it takes this really sleek cool approach which is so signature triple s if you think about it with a little bit of tad bit of new jack swing not fully with it because i know when it comes to New Jack Swing, not everyone's on the same page for that genre and influence. Uh, at least for me, knowing the the well, at least the two of my my friends and, and slash fans of Triple S, they don't really mess with New Jack Swing. Uh, if we're talking about Crystal Eyes, messed with some of the tracks, not all of them, right? Uh, New Jack Swing is not the most popular genre out there, and I wouldn't say uh, so, but like, for me, New Jack Swing is so up my alley, in terms of my alley. But it takes a tad bit of that New Jack Swing, not fully. Um, and I, I like how cool it is. It, it has this coolness, quote unquote, factor. I don't know how to exactly describe it. But I love how that bass guitar plays out. And I feel like the vocal layering can be so phenomenal in that song. But then, Too Hot. 
Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to narrow it down between Too Hot and Soul Vice. Strategically speaking, I think I would vote for Too Hot because maybe others will lean more towards Too Hot and um, will be able to carry and bring that track out upon the voting rounds, you know what I'm saying, versus Soul Vice. I can just tell that, you know, Soul Vice wouldn't really be everyone's cup of tea, but people would admire it one way or another in terms of how it played out so far in this preview, right? But uh, tough decision. Too hot. Soul Vice. I got to give it slightly to too hot here. Um, but pretty much all of these tracks so up my alley in terms of taste. And some of these tracks, what we truly love and know, the bread and butter of Triple S pretty much. But also two tracks, whether it's like Too Hot, would really work for Triple S, right? Assemble 24 as a whole. But then you got Soul Vice that takes this slightly different approach, pivots it, pivot, like a slightly different pivot, right? But maintaining that signature sound and side to triple s you feel me so i think if anything like i wouldn't mind all of these tracks on the upcoming release like it it seems quite cohesive it with it matter of fact these four songs together like i wouldn't take out any of these songs if i was at that boardroom if i was at the table you feel me but then again i really enjoyed majority of the tracks from day one so tough decision i'm gonna have to go with too hot let me know in the comment section down below your top two favorites um out of the bunch i'm sure atmosphere has to be up there automatically right we can come to a common consensus with that but take care as always this has been garrison be sure to like and subscribe as it goes a long way and it helps out the channel so so much and peace